of fishing last week um, with the hot weather, it was, it was too difficult. Um, but yeah, there was no video, unfortunately, but I'm not going to post a video, a video where blank. I don't know if you can hear me with the wind, it's a bit loud. I'm just at Triage Bay at the moment, uh, family's down on the beach, so I've come up on the flagpole and just fishing for bass. But just cast out as I was setting stuff up. And yeah. got my action camera, I'm thinking about dropping it down, we're going to have to weight it up so there's not going to be any chest camera, it should be videos like this. But yeah, not a bad little fish. But fun, get, uh, fun on the light stuff anyway, but I don't know if you can see the colours. Yep, let's get it back, get another one. Getting loads of bikes, just missing a lot of them because they're... So I'm getting loads of bikes, just missing loads of them because they're tiny like this. Tiny little pollock. Oh, you can see that, but yeah. Tiny little pollock. Good fun now. Just using uh, sabikis, cut into three hooks. So I just cut the sabikis, normally come in six, cut them in half. Just tie them off and then use little bits of rag. Nice and simple, but yeah. Nice little pollock. I just want to give you a tip. All these are spines. You've got spines where they are nothing and spines where the gill plates, so just be very careful when holding them. It can be quite painful and they jump a lot, so yeah, just be careful. Pollock, slippery on this one. Yep, another little pollock. So that's two rafts, two pollock. Beautiful colours on it. Just easy fishing. Third species, so I've had two pollock, three, ba uh, three cork wings. First little barling. It's how it's barling because it's not got a spot on the middle of the wrist of the tail. And as you can tell, it's not got all the colours around the head that a cork wing has. But yeah, third species. I'll show you how I'm catching them, it's really easy. Yeah, I'll show you the rig. But yeah, just get that back. Tiny little hooks, that's a hook, bear. 
tiny bits of rag and just down to a lad, around the lad. Really easy, like so. Let's get another one. One. Right, so uh, I can't get in the best view I can, but got another cork ring here, and the spot is a lot more prominent on this one, so I thought I'd show you this one. But just there, next to the tail, you can see it, really prominent spot. Colours around the head a lot better. Like say in a ballon, you don't get the colours like that. And ballons don't have that spot. If it's got a spot on the top of the wrist, it's a gold cine, but if it's in the middle, it's a cork wing. Nice and easy, but you get used to it once you catch a few of them. Not all spots are that prominent, but they will still have that spot. It's going back. lot of cork rings around which I don't mind because I love cork rings they're beautiful fish I like to unhook them on this water just in case I do drop them then they'll just go straight back there we go straight back Swim down. Have a look. Another little cork wing. God, such so many spikes. We've got cork ring, okay. Spot isn't as prominent on that one. Colours are still really nice though. So clear there. Yeah. Yeah. Finally caught a shiny. I got to the sea. Shiny. Four species now. The problem is I'm having is these little hooks are bending out, which you never used to, I don't know if they've changed how they made them or what, but yeah, they keep bending out quite easily, so I have to change rigs. Rigs. So I changed the rig because those hooks just kept bending out and getting snapped. So another cork ring, colour still in again. I had tons of these, loads of shannies as well. Quick 
police. I'm just using a little bit of bait, trying to catch a bit of any, everything to be honest, but that's green one. Let's see if I can show you the teeth. Very much so. Yeah. Look at those teeth. They've got big teeth. Very nice fish. It's going to come back, see if we can get a bigger one. Right, a bit bigger one again. Got a nice little red to it, this one. I love about rocks, well, so many different colours you get, but you know, like I say, all these are spines, all around the animal fin spines, all fins, and then, and then the gill cover as well, it's got really sharp spines, so just be careful with these, only ones that haven't got spines in the tail, but yeah, another nice one. That's the biggest cork wing of the day. Colours are not stunning, I mean, especially on the gill covers. You don't expect to find fish as beautiful in this country, but all the colours along the fins, gill covers, beautiful fish. Love catching these, not caught these in quite a while, but you know, whenever I get a chance, I love coming down here and just fishing for the little ones. It's great fun. Let's get it back. Alright, guys, we the last one, packing up now. But yeah, it's been a good session. Pull this underwater camera and see what it got. Alright, see you in the next one. Tell Lions, thanks for watching.